Hey guys, this is Eric Bullock from RSD, and tonight we have a really special treat for you. When I'm teaching my black belts a spear form or a new staff form, at the end of the class we usually do what I call spear push-ups or staff push-ups. And we're going to alternate our grip. The first grip, you're just going to hold it normally like that. But when you do this, look guys, put your knuckles down on the floor. Don't hold it like this on the floor. Use that wrist. So it's going to work on that wrist stability. It's going to help your fist a lot. Usually we do a substantial amount more of these. I'm just going to do 10 on each one for tonight for video. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, so that's the easy one. Now we're going to progress up. One hand will be this way, and the other hand is this way now. Okay, so whichever one you want to do it, I'm going to do 10 on each one of these two. You ready? One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Awesome. So, as you guessed, now we're going to flip it and do it the opposite way. Now, when you start doing this at home, you're going to notice it works a lot of different muscles in your arms and your chest. Get ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, and ten. Good. Shake it out. Now we'll move on to the last one. And this is probably, for some people it's the hardest one. For some people it's a little bit easier. But this is the reverse one. Try to stay up on your knuckles. Do full range of motion. You got it. Get ready. Ten more of these. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And 10. Awesome job. So guys, at home, you probably got a stick, you know, broomstick, short stick, spear, whatever you've got. Try this workout at home. And later on, we may even do some variants of some of the things that we do here in another video. Thank you guys. Awesome job.